What is a kilogram? You might say, it's just a measure of weight. But the story of the kilogram is far more fascinating than you think. For centuries, people measured weight using stones, grains, and local standards. But this led to chaos. The trade was inconsistent, and science demanded precision. In 1795, France introduced a new universal system, the metric system. And at its heart was the kilogram, defined as the mass of one liter of water at four degrees Celsius. Simple, right? But measuring water precisely wasn't practical. So scientists created a physical object, the International Prototype Kilogram, a platinum iridium cylinder stored in France in 1889. This tiny cylinder became the world's standard of mass, locked in a vault with official copies distributed globally. For over 100 years, every kilogram measurement traced back to this single object. But there was a problem. That cylinder wasn't perfect. Over time, it lost atoms. Tiny changes, just micrograms. But this meant the definition of mass itself was drifting. Science needed something better. So in 2019, the world redefined the kilogram. Not by a physical object, but by a fundamental constant of nature. The Planck constant. A number that never changes. Using a device called the Kibble Balance, scientists linked mass to the speed of light, the Planck constant, and specific atomic transition frequency. The kilogram was now tied to the very laws of the universe. Today, a kilogram is no longer a hunk of metal in a vault. It's a concept, grounded in the fabric of reality. Precise, unchanging, universal.